everybody, SMA Wants here. We're about to continue our Let's Play of the Blood Elf Paladin. We haven't actually played this one in a little over a month, actually. And I just felt like I would come back and give Dor Dust Dorgen off, make sure. I mean, he's very well rested. Um, <laughs> but uh, we're going to go back to, uh, we're back here in Stranglethorn Vale. And we are about to, last time we left off, we had killed some raptor eggs for Commander Angrogosh here. And uh, we're going to see what he wants us to do next. Lotar. Welcome to Gromgall, Paladin. Before we get off on the wrong foot, I'll have you know that I won't have any slackers in my base camp. I expect a healthy blood elf like you to pull your own weight around here. The Defense of Gromgall. When we first arrived in the jungle, we did not intend to wage war on the local tribes. Our mission to supply Stonard is one of highest priority. But complications have arisen. A local band of ogres has occupied the Mizenja ruins to the southeast of Gromgal. Despite warnings, they continue to ambush our supply caravans. I'm putting you in charge of dealing with these uncooperative ogres. Travel to the ruins and attempt to drive them from the area. At the very least, it will send a firm message. Dabu. The Merkgill Murlocs have been pushed out of the, o out of the ocean by the Salt Scale Murlocs. So they make their re yeah. so they make their refuge in Kal Al ruins to the northeast. This was acceptable in the past, but no longer. Separated from the sea, the Merkgill have grown restless and have sent their foragers to attack my supply caravans. Send them a message: this behavior will not be tolerated by Hellscream's horde. Straight. I think I... Speak. It looks like your young raptor is hungry. If you're looking to help to keep her, why don't you find something for her to eat? The lash tail often attack the camps of Merkgills just to our north. She probably isn't strong enough to hunt on her own yet, but make sure, I mean, I'm sure she'll eat freshly killed murloc meat. Are the horde! I forgot I have my own little pet. Well, I have a... Uh, we got a mana worm here now, too. Because I like having the uh, Mr. Mittens for my undead monk, so we're going to... The Blood Elf's going to have his pet mana worm. Hmm. I haven't decided exactly what to name the pet mana worm yet. Thinking about it, it'll have a name when when it feels right, though. Oh, how about Slither? Slithers? I like Slithers. We'll call them Slithers. <laughs> Disfigured Mongosh Hand. This ogre was carrying an unusual item, the severed hand of another ogre, tied to a piece of string and worn around the neck. The hand itself is marked heavily with faint scars that, grow in f that glow a faint purple. A scar that glows after death is highly unusual, and to find such an item on an ogre is even stranger. Perhaps someone back at Gromgall will know what to do with this oddity. Sweet, sweet ore. We need to find witch doctors. You're a witch doctor. Alright. 
That's actually more ogres, more brutes than I needed. I need to kill witch doctors. Witch doctor. <laughs> have a uh, offensive outlet. Wow, they're just leveled. I, say, I don't really have an offensive outlet for my uh, holy power, so I need to remember to occasionally heal myself with it. Alright, last witch doctor I need. Thunk. That is actually a really big crocodile. Alright, now we need to go kill some more ogres. I actually meant murlocs, but the ogres seem to have a desire to get killed. Kalai runes. Eat up, little guy. Yeah, actually, I think the little raptor's probably gonna. Oh wait, I don't think the little raptor. You, I don't think you keep the little raptor. Come on, little guy in slithers. And that hits hard. Like when that thing crits, it lays into them. Eat up. Come on, dig in. I think he's going to be full long before I've killed enough Murlocs. Decay. 
decapitating sword of the bear. Well, that is actually something I assume for the mod alone someone's going to want for transmog. Uh, he seems almost completely fed. Shame I'm not as close to being done with uh, killing Murlocs. Uh, he's all fed. He ate it all gone. Like a good little raptor. Take me back to Gromgal, which I know it isn't far, but it's far enough. That's definitely still faster. Blood and thunder. A hand, you say? Farseer makes sure of, to hold the item by the string, carefully avoiding the dead ogre's fist. Strange indeed. I will pass this on to my contacts in the east, near Mogoshin base camp. I have a feeling that this interest in this strange scars. You have my thanks, Blood Elf. Farewell. She looks bigger already. You can see those raptors grow quickly. You're, you're lucky to have found such a strong companion. Keep her by your side as long as you can, Dordrin. I'm sure she will prove to be an asset in the future. Victory. So, so. Excellent work. Hopefully the raids will stop now. I have one more task for you, Dordrin. For the horde. I see you are good for more than simply egg-smashing duty. Good. The horde can use a capable blood elf like you. Alright, and that'll do it for this video. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you'll watch the next one we continue to find out what we can do here at uh, Gromgall Base Camp.